guys. I'm at the Oak Shade Cemetery in uh, Marion, Iowa, which is in uh, Lynn County. It was the original county seat here until about 1917 when it was uh, moved to Cedar Rapids. And uh, this is the municipal cemetery uh, owned by the city. It's the only cemetery in the city. Uh, I think well over 8,000 burials out here. Uh, still a very active, active cemetery. Um, so very well maintained uh, for a municipal cemetery, a municipal cemetery this size. So we're here um, for the grave of Mansell v. Root or Root, I think, depending on where you're from. Awesome. Who is Mansell? He's right around here. So there he is, straight ahead. He was a Civil War uh, veteran, member of the Grand Army of the Republic. Here we are. Mansell v. Root, Company E, 36, 36th Wisconsin Infantry. His wife, Ida Barnhart Root, 1866 to 1939. So, let's talk a little bit about Mansell Root here and why we're visiting his grave today. He is reportedly the youngest soldier to serve uh, for the Union Army uh, during the Civil War. He was a drummer for Company E, 36th Wisconsin Infantry. His regiment was in a number of actions in the East, including the Battle of the Wilderness. Mansell was captured at Deep Bottom, uh, Virginia, and he was later exchanged uh, for you know prisoner exchange, and he rejoined his regiment. Like I said, it was said that he was the, uh, the youngest soldier in the Union Army. After the war, he lived in Wisconsin, moved to Cedar Rapids in 1900. He was known to play drums on patriotic occasions. Uh, unfortunately, he was crossing the street in Cedar Rapids, the neighboring community here, on July 6, 1929, and he was killed after being struck by a, uh, an automobile. So, doing the, uh, the quick little math here based on his... Uh, uh, he was uh, he was born 1854, so that would have put him enlisted around the age of 11. Uh, so 11 years old and, and uh, serving his country during uh, serving the Union uh, as a uh, as a drummer in the Civil War at 11 years old. Uh, you think about most 11 year olds nowadays. Um, uh, they're not doing that. So a very typical. Uh, veteran grave here. He's got the plaque for the Grand Army of the Republic, the GAR, 1861 to 1865. American flag here. This is Memorial Day out here, so I uh, would expect everything to be, uh, have all the flags and everything. So let's do a quick little walk around here. Like I said, shouldn't be anything on the back. His wife is up on hers either. This is being the, uh, the northeast portion of the uh, extreme northeast portion of the, uh, of the cemetery here, right off the road there. Pretty easy to find. I will throw the, the GPS coordinates into the uh, into the description here. I don't know the abbreviations of MUS there. It's not one I'm familiar with, so I'll have to have that in the description as well. There you go, guys. The grave of Mansell v. Root, or Root, depending on where you're from. Uh, the youngest, youngest soldier in the, uh, well, youngest uh, serving in the Civil War as a drummer for the Union Army.